and welcome everyone to another exciting episode of the Super Carling Gaming Pokemon Soul Silver Randomizer Nuzlocke Challenge. I was like, am I forgetting a word? Randomizer, that's the one, and that's the important one because this is a randomizer Nuzlocke where the Pokemon are just all over the place. Let's have a look at the ones we have caught thus far. Okay, so the last episode we caught Gloob, the Drifloon. Um, and I was trying to decide, really, if I should replace Morozova with Gloob. And I really was leaning towards doing it, but I was looking at the stuff that Gloob learns, or the Drifloons learn, and it's just really not that good for a very long time, whereas Morozova is already so good. So even though I would really love to have a ghost flying type on the team, at the moment, I'm holding off. Maybe if we get some better TMs, I was like, oh, flying type, didn't we get a flying TM from the, the first gym, Faulkner, isn't that his name? Um, but, and we did, but it's Roost, and they can't even learn it! So that was annoying. So at the moment, here's where we're at. Um, we've got Dalton, the Pillow Swine. We've got Tristan, the Kadabra, who flew up in levels last episode. We have Ice, the standoffish Magmortar. We have Morozova. Uh, Miles, our mighty, I can never, Luxio, right? Luxio, Luxio. And Peppers, who I'm wearing, look, I got whales on my shirt for Peppers today because I knew I was recording. I was like, ooh, whales. I can does, can does. By the way, I love that Riley has put the little to, not to scale warning on the Peppers avatar. It's hard to conceptualize how big Waylords are they but they big like it's like a whole blimp is following me around it looks tiny but it's like a whole blimp following me around so the tricky thing we have going today is that we're going to try and get our second gym badge right here boom right in there but first we have to go clear out the rockets from over here in the slowpoke well right no big deal except perhaps you've noticed that Miles is already level 17, which is an issue because Bugsy's top level Pokemon is 17, and one of the rules we have going in this Nuzlocke is that we cannot we cannot level past the next gym leader's top level Pokemon. So we really can't use Miles at the moment, which makes me wonder, like, should we just put Miles in the box so we don't risk it, so we make sure we have access to Miles during the gym? But then, like, it feels weird putting Miles in the box, too. Like, this is a whole new element to the Nuzlocke. It also means we have to be very careful. We can only use Tristan limitedly. Uh, same for everyone else. So we should also probably try and get Dalton a level or two before we get in there. It's, there's much to consider. But the, the very firstiest... What is this? Is this where you go to get the cool Pokeballs? Is this Kurt's house? All right, hold on. Let's go in here, because this guy maybe can give us useful Pokeballs. Right? Ah, who are you? Yeah, you want to make some balls? Sorry, but that'll have to wait. Do you know Team Rocket? Oh, okay. Okay. Oh. Apparently we had to go talk to him first anyway. So it's a good thing we went and talked to him. Uh, but before we go do that, let's go into this Ilex Forest where we can catch a... Oh, wait. That lady looked suspiciously like she wanted to give us something. No, that was wrong. She does not. Ilex Forest, here we go. We, I'm just going in here so we can catch something because who knows, maybe it's something amazing we want to add to the team right away, but maybe not. Uh, let's see. Do you just run into stuff in this? Is this the area? Can we just run into stuff running around? Or is this going to do it to play some weird... Am I completely wrong? Okay, you can, this is a catch, a potential catch, and it's a stunky. Interesting, interesting. I'm not sure Stunky is quite team material, but Skuntank, I don't know, they, they bulky, they dark. Let's go with the hypnosis. Yeah. I think we can probably just catch this thing without even having to do much damage. Not that I think we can even do much damage. Um, let's go with the Astonish, maybe. Oh, so little damage, okay. So let's maybe do that once or twice more. I think we can honestly just astonish it down. You got the flinch, let's go back to the hypnosis. We missed, let's go for the hypnosis. There it is, okay, more is over. Well done, well done. And then we go back and we go Pokeball and we catch it. Who wants to be the stunky? I feel like we're gonna catch it. Boom, we did it. Well done, stunks. Stunk it up. All right, now we gotta go find a name. Hold, please. Oh, it's Poison Dark. I didn't know it was Poison Dark. That's interesting, that's interesting. Hold on. 
Noel, Noel for Noel Han in the comments. Thank you for watching. Welcome to the box. All right, now then, let's see. If we run into something crazy cool on the way out, I'm gonna feel frustrated. So far not. All right. We can also catch something in the Slowpoke well itself. Uh, we may as well heal because why not? You know, you never can be too careful with these things. There we go. And part of me thinks we should just leave with Dalton so we can get um, the any extra experience we need and we'll switch if we need to. Come on out, Dalts. There we go, there we go. And we're heading down into the Slowpoke well. All right, ooh, 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 ooh. I can walk. Excellent. So normally you can really just only catch Slowpoke in here. God, hey there, Jay. The guard up top took off when I shouted at him, but then I took a tumble down the well. I slammed down hard on my back so I can't move. Rats. If I were fit, my Pokemon would have punished them. Ah, it can't be helped. Show them how gutsy you are. It seems like your Pokemon can still do it, even if you can't. Anyway, uh, we can catch something in here. Also, we're gonna have some fights. Let's fight this guy first, though. Boy, immediately my anxiety comes back to like, oh wait, who knows what they're gonna have? They could, I mean, do you remember the guy with the Giratina and the Rayquaza? Like, this is this is what's gonna happen. Like, that that fight ended up being okay because they were only like level six, but I guarantee you at some point, like the gym leader is gonna just bust out something insane and have Mewtwo or something. Oh, uh, look, this guy's a Nuzleaf. Hey, that sounds like Nuzlocke. Is that a coincidence? No, it's not. Uh, in case you're wondering where the word Nuzlocke comes from, it's from the very first person who came up with the rules. They did like a webcomic and they had a Nuzleaf who I think made it, I think it was their first death and they named it John Locke. So that it was like Nuzlocke, get yeah, Nuzlocke, Nuzleaf. Um, and that's basically it. And everyone's called it that ever since. Super popular fun way to play the game. Here we go. And the Mankers. Okay, so we're actually a little bit weak to this one. I want to say we could just take it down anyway. But why be risky? Why be risky? Don't get don't get crazy. Here, let's go. Let's switch into ice here. Take that. Ice who has a literal a literal cannon for an arm. Throws the ember at you. That's it. Don't go to level 11. Nicely done. All right. That guy was that guy seemed reasonable. Let's go. I want to we can catch a pokemon in here. Oh, a super potion. That's nice. We can catch something in here, right? I'm pretty sure because normally you just run into slow pokes. Maybe you can't do it until, oh, a Sharpedo! Okay, that's fun. I think we could, oh, we can uh, rock smash it for, let's dart. Oh, and we flinched, oh no. Get the leer on us, I don't like that. Okay, but we are definitely doing way more damage. Oh, he has rough skin though, going for the rage. There's certain things, okay, so like, we have to try and be aware of like rough skin, definitely, look, it doesn't do little amounts of damage, that's pretty good. Um, we have to, something else to be aware of is like if we're against drift loons or anything. So same situation here. We can probably I'm we're a little low on health, but I feel comfortable just rock smashing it if we heal up first. Drift loons have an ability called aftermath, which is a really scary ability that well that wasn't super great. I think vice grip means we can't switch though. Oh, look, it got its defense right on back. All right, that's okay. Because it just wasted a turn. And we got it. There we go. Dalton, can you get that level? Yeah, oh, absolutely getting the level. Flying through these guys. Well done, Dalton. Boy, I'm very happy we have the pillow swine on the team. That's such a strong thing. But Aftermath, really scary ability. Um to come into contact with because what it does is when said Pokemon dies, it does like 25, I think if you do a damage, it's like a physically damaging attack, it can do like 25% of your health when it dies. It's just like, that's the aftermath of its death. It takes damage on you. And if you're not ready for it, it can just destroy you. Um, so we have to be very careful of that. Rough skin, another thing to be, there's more abilities that are dangerous to us this time around. Um, yes, yeah, so that's, we just we just got to be careful. We just got to be careful of stuff like that. Uh, I also it also is unfortunate that I believe. Oh look, super potion. That's very nice. I think our gloob, our Drifloon has aftermath. So I don't even think we can uh, take advantage of whatever ability they might otherwise have because well because it obviously won't come into con come into effect unless it died. Oh, an Aeron. Yeah, we fought many of your kind, haven't we? 
Lorelei. <laughs> yeah, pretty much the same. And a Breloom! Okay, so this is tricky because the fight we're weak to the fighting, we're strong against the grass. Um, oh, let's see. Is there anyone? Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Do we have anyone who's good against grass? Oh, yeah. There's Ice, who has a literal cannon for an arm. Um, oh, yeah. You missed. How about Ember? In your face, Breloom. You're dead. You're nothing. You're weak. Tentacruel. You're scary, and I don't like you. See, this is a situation where I would love to be able to go to Miles, but also we can go to Tristan. Oh. Um, Constrict! Nothing, nothing. Extra sensory, my man! You're dead! You're an embarrassment to Tentacruels. Tentacruels are a really good Pokemon to actually have on your team for does like they're very they're like fast and strong and defensive. Which is everything you want. So that guy up there though looks like a rocket admin of some of some description, which makes me a little bit more nervous. Who perhaps Maybe we don't lead with Dalton on that fight. Perhaps we lead with the mighty Morozova here. Okay, there we go. So we can throw an Intimidate on whatever they have. A proton, which we have here. I'm often labeled as the scariest and cruelest guy in Team Rocket. I strongly urge you not to interfere with our business. Okay, Proton. Well, we'll just see about that. Oh, and Nidoran. Well, I can see why you're so scary. <laughs> Um, that was a joke. Watch him a poison point, though. Am I gonna get poisoned? Nope! And a machop! Okay, so also not a huge deal. Um, we are weak to the machop, though, so we don't like that. Let's go to Big Pep. Big Pep! Oh! Oh, I forgot we had the shell bell. But we should be able to just knock him out right here. Yes. That shell bell only does like two HP back, but that you can't, it doesn't look like much, but stuff like that adds up. Hey, we did it. Look, we got rid of um, Hooray. We're amazing. Well done, Peppers. Hi, Kurt. Way to go, JT Rocket's taking off. My back's better too. Uh, just in the nick of time. Wow. I think we're gonna go back down there because I want to catch something. You handed us something right here. As I mentioned, Team Rocket was just abandoned by a boy called Red three years ago. A boy called Red? Who could that have been? It was us. Now that I have come back, I have a bad feeling about it. In any case, it would please me greatly to make Pokeballs for a trainer like you. That's all I have for now. A fast ball. Okay, cool. Hey! Oh boy, what? I don't know which one we should do. Let's say black. Two! Two black. Yes. Okay, cool. It'll take a day to make a Pokeball. I'll come back for it later. Yeah, okay. I guess just call me when it's ready. I'll take your phone number because I want the Pokeballs because I'm bad at remembering to buy them. Now Team Rocket is gone. We're going to go back into the Slowpoke well and try and catch something. Of course. Of course. Got to have as many options as is possible to have. Because who knows? Maybe there's some. Maybe there's something crazy and amazing down here. Maybe this is where Mew is hiding. You know? How great would that be? Let's try and catch it. If there's, you know, I'm. Cause I I know you can. Okay, here we go. I was like, you definitely catch them. Natu. Mm, well, we already have a psychic type. We don't have flying. But mm, disappointment reigns. Um. Put you to sleep, friend. Let's see if we can just catch it. We'll go straight for the Great Ball. Huh? 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 We got it! Just like that. Nice and easy. Natu, welcome to probably the box. Natu is one of those Pokemon that whenever I come up against them, I'm always like, oh no. Flying Psychic is just tricky typing to deal with a lot of the time. Because they just, I don't I don't know why, it always messes with me like, uh, Siglyph, same way. I'm like, what do I do? How do I fight this thing? Thunder, thunder, thunder is always the answer. Miles would have destroyed this thing. Yes, we need a nickname. Melanie, for Melanie Brunner in the comments. 
Thank you for watching. Welcome for the time being to the box. All right, and now let's see, we should probably do some amount of tr training for Dalton, just a little bit, because let's, yeah, where are we levels wise? Okay, let's just go get one more level, I think, for Doll. That'll make me feel a little better. I say that. Watch it. Watch watch Bugsy be the one. He's gonna have some he's gonna have something terrible. I just know it. Ugh, he's making me nervous already. I don't I'm already nervous about the fight. Who knows how it's gonna go. Oh look, we're we're gonna get this one real quick though. Look, bam. I bet we get the level right there. Hey, we did it! 13, amazing. Mud slap, forget a move, for sure. Let's get rid of Mud Sport because it's terrible. And there we go. A mud oh, what? What how, how did we not fight you last time? Did you just like look away? I would have been afraid too if I were you. Um, we're gonna switch to because it's raining, so that's not great. Uh, I think we'll just go. We'll just go to let's go to Morizo again. Oh, it has agility. Okay, so it can benefit. It's benefiting from the rain, which typically I don't think this um, hiker would get the benefit of. Ugh! Come on, Morizova. Of course, it's so fast and only getting faster. No big deal. Confusion, we should be able to handle that. MBD, yeah. Stomp. That's what happened. My, my big old deer just stomped on your fish. Uh-huh, rain continues to fall. We know all about the rain falling. <clears throat> and then we stomped your low tad into uh, nothingness. Mars over gained a level and everything's happier. Dude, no, do not, I do not want your number. Go away. Oh look, apricurns. Another one. What about you? Do you fight? Okay. Oh, guess not. And we're back. Okay, so I think where we're at, all we need to do now is, uh, we can't, unfortunately, we can't, like, just go in and, like, prep at all for how we're going to do this fight because the... Uh, oh, one of these fun puzzles. Uh, this one? Because everyone's completely random, right? So. Oh, I see. But if we wanted to, like, fight that guy, we would have needed to uh, flip the switch a different way. Well, whatever. Maybe we didn't want to fight him. It's really, the gym leaders are much less, because they're not type themed at all, it's much more just a situation of, they're just the hard trainers. They're just the ones that we will absolutely have the highest levels against. We don't like that. Um, let's go to see. This is the, the only issue using Kadabra is that <laughs> Kadabra is really, it's like a glass cannon. So switching into Kadabra is always the tricky part. Like, that was pretty good. That was pretty good. We got lucky there. It's... Kadabra is so strong. Tristan is so strong. I mean, we got so lucky with this hatch, getting this beautiful little Abra that is that was born with extra sensory. Normally, Abras are just... They have nothing. You know, you just had to sit there and switch trade them. And we have extra sensory, which is, like, basically psychic, which is one of the best psychic moves in the game. Right at, from, like... It's, it's OP. Okay, now Tristan is level 17 as well, though. Oh, it's a Moltres! Okay. Okay, see what I mean? See, what if this was Bugsy? What if? What if? We're gonna switch to Peps. That is a cool looking Moltres. I like that. Except that it's on the ground. I mean, it's a legendary bird. It probably should be. Don't you think it should be flying? Water gun. Think. Oh, yeah. Well, unsurprisingly... Oh, are we burned? No. Unsurprisingly, um, Moltres the legendary bird survived our water gun. There we go. Peppers did it. Took him down. Even the legendary bird is no match for our giant whale. Surprise. Surprise. So if we do that, we'll go... We'll end up fighting... So we're going to do a few fights here. I don't really mind doing more fights, though. We'll just go fight this guy. We want the experience. You saved all the slowpoke? Woo, you're mighty. 
Yeah, where were you guys? Where was Bugsy? Shouldn't this have been his job? It's his town. Whatever. These gym leaders, no responsibility. Just relying on traveling. Uh oh, uh oh, Granados, oh goodness. We're gonna go right to Peppers. Headbutt, oh boy. All right, water gun. There it is, there it is. We get a little help back. Yeah, a little bit. Okay, boy. Dangerous Pokemon, Cranidos. Dangerous. Dangerous indeed. They have very high attack, but, and in a, what is it, Diamond and Pearl, I wanna say it's the first gym leader has, oh, oh, hold on, hold the phone. Who else are we fighting with? Who's our teammate? He has a Shinx too! Okay, okay, let's see. What's the situation here? Is ice even a good battler for this situation? They've got electric and ground. <laughs> that heap of botasses. Let's, let's, okay, we're gonna fight with Dalton. And we're gonna, yeah. We're going to mud slap on Shinx. And then we're gonna switch Ice out for more Zova to throw the double Intimidate. Ready? Here we go. K intimidated. Yeah, that's what I thought. Tackle and a bite. Okay, no big deal. Oh, Sandstorm though. So Dalton actually, well, it doesn't get hurt by it because he's part ground. So we're gonna mud slap on the Shinx again. That should pretty much do that. And then I think we can just stomp on Hippopotas here. Hippopotas, whoo, very, very good Pokemon for sure. I think I had one on my very first uh, Pearl team. Hippopotas flinched, okay. Look at him just like this, not even standing. He's just like, huh, uh, you wanna fight? All right, I guess I can be bothered. Dead. No problem. Ice, getting the level. All right, all right. There we go. I guess we have to flip this switch. And then go like this. Ride our little thing back down. <laughs> flip switch. And then are we healed and ready for the gym battle? Everyone's mostly good. Everyone's mostly good. Uh, who to lead with? We can actually lead with Miles if we want. We can use Miles and Tristan again in this fight. It's okay if they level up during the fight. We just couldn't get them over leveled before the fight. So worth remembering. We're back up to the full six now. Um, I think the only thing I'm gonna do bag wise is use just this last little potion to get Peppers back to full or almost to full anyway, right? Um, who to lead with though? I like leading with Morozova, I think, because of the potential for the hypnosis and the guaranteed intimidate. That is always that is always good. I think other than that, we don't have much strategy. They're gonna have a level 17 something, but we have two level 17 somethings and they're Kadabra and Luxio and they're gonna freaking wreck. We gotta get Miles a battle here. We haven't been able to use them basically the whole episode. Unacceptable, don't like that. <sighs> All right. Let's do this, Bugs. You got nothing, my man. Your weird purple hair. I mean, this is fine. What's wrong with purple hair? I'm Bugsy. I never lose when it comes to bug type Pokemon. My research is going to make me the authority on bug type. I don't know. This is def that would definitely not be this guy's voice. He looks so happy. Ha <laughs> ha. I love bug type Pokemon. Do I have any? A Toga Kiss. So fully evolved. Okay. Oh, he's starting with the level 17 as well. Does, is that. Is that how this goes? Is this his ace? Is he leading with the ace? Or does he just have two level 17s? It doesn't seem like you can lead with your ace. That doesn't seem allowed. Let's just stomp this thing right out of, oh, or sphere, okay. <gasps> what was that? Is aura sphere a fighting move? I thought, I thought it was a steel move. Also, why do you have it at all? That, what was, oh, okay. Okay, that wasn't good. That was bad. Oh my gosh, Morozova, I am so sorry. What just, oh, Bugsy, you killed my deer. You killed my deer, and you 
you must die now. You will have to face the wrath of Spark. The probably the fate. Oh gosh, Oops. Miles. How fast is this thing, Miles? <gasps> Oh, what is this? It has a burn. Oh my gosh. I'm so nervous. It can hit us twice more and it's faster. Oh no, oh no. That aura sphere is insanity. Okay. <clears throat> the, okay, hold on. Let me think, let me think, let me think. <laughs> let me think. Aura spell is obviously a fighting type of attack. It is doing a lot of damage. Let's see. Let's who can who can take it? Tristan can take an aura sphere because Tristan is psychic and resists fighting. Okay, maybe we should go there. Or let's see. Um, check moves. Boost the power of the next of the election. Also raises special defense. Okay, okay. Maybe we just do a quick charge, right? Maybe we just go for a charge, and then we go for a potion, because then we'll have higher special defense and a stronger spark. Okay. Oh gosh. Please don't crit. Please don't crit. Oh god, I'm so nervous. Oh! Why did I do that? Why? It fell. Oh, man, I, like it worked. It worked. I knew this was gonna happen, but oh my gosh. Woo, okay. Okay. Super push. Go super push. And now, extreme speed! You have nothing, my man. This should not do as much damage because we did the charge, so it should be, we should be safe. <clears throat> Miles, you can do this. Destroy that weird bird thing. Are you, why, why? Okay, but it's paralyzed, so that's good. So now we should go first, and we should kill. It is a super potion. Oh, 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 I don't like it. That's okay, because we should do half, right? We should do at least half. And then we should be, oh gosh, it's so close. What if he What if he hangs on and then hits us with something strong? He's not going to. Miles, you have this. Why, why am I being so risky? Oh, it's dead. Thank goodness. Okay, get a level. Can we get a level? We, I think we earned it. Okay, a little bit of health, a little bit of strength. And we still have that special defense buff. Let's learn bite. We're gonna move. Yeah, let's get rid of Leer. There we go. Whew, almost got two levels off the thing and a lot of lick a tongue, a lick a tongue. Oh boy. Oh my gosh. Miles can probably keep fighting, but um, maybe we should heal. Maybe we should heal. We could also, I don't know what this thing could have. Like, look, it's like a normal type, so it could have just anything in the moves department. Maybe, maybe not. I mean, it's probably just got like, <sighs> okay, here's what we're gonna do. Okay, this is our last super potion, so. There we go. It's the, oh, it's the fence curling. Okay. So it's afraid of us. I would be too. I was it. Just go for the spark. <clears throat> Supersonic. Oh gosh. I don't like that. I do not like that. Don't want to hit ourselves. Maybe we should switch here. <clears throat> Let's go to... We're gonna switch to ice. I want to try and poison it. Fence curl. Oh, we have smoke screen too. Smog. It missed! We missed with smog! Ember? Let's see how this does. Man! Okay, it's going for all of the. So far, it hasn't attacked us at all. We're just gonna throw another intimidate on it. That's gonna work. Defense curl. Oh gosh. Okay. Let's go for the spark. Maybe it doesn't have any attacking moves. It seems like it's just using supersonic and defense curl. Again. Okay. Well, I feel fine shifting because it's not like um, it's done any damage at all. Now we can just ember it down. 
Okay. This should be his ace coming out, though. Whatever that's going to be. Unless he led with the ace somehow. Oh, it's an Infernape! Oh, gosh. Okay. <clears throat> so he did lead with the ace somehow. Does he always do that? I did not know that. Um, Infernape? Scary. Do love Infernape as a Pokemon. Not important, though. Let's smoke screen it. Oh, it's going for the taunter. No, we're not going to be able to use it. Okay, let's switch that. Let's go back to... We can go to Tristan. Let's get the... Okay, let's go to Miles to throw an Intimidate, because it does have a lot of physical attack. Taunt. Okay, you want it? You want You want to bring the pain? You asked for it, man. You asked for this. Yeah, and you're paralyzed. Okay, lots of really fast Pokemon. Jeez. And he had mock punch anyway. See, I'm glad we did the intimidate. Boom. Miles for the victory. Well done, Miles. Well done. We did it. Two levels in that fight. Wow. 1800. My goodness, we did it. Whoa, amazing! You're an expert on Pokemon! My research isn't complete yet. Okay, you win. Take this badge. The high badge. Da -da -da, da -da 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 -da. Yeah. What does he give us? Is it anything good? U turn! That is good. Okay. I like that. He didn't use it at all. Oh, because well, he doesn't have his regular bugs. That's why. I think that's why he leads with the uh, with the Scyther, maybe normally, is because he has U-Turn, and U-Turn, uh, he'll just U-Turn out, but hit you with something strong, and then waste your time. Oh my goodness. Well, that said, we have um, a bit of a, a bit of a sad moment, though. Bugsy, the jerk, uh... Knocked out one of our Pokemon. Our first death on this run. And I did not see it coming at all. I totally thought we were going to be okay. Um, we were not. That Aura Sphere was insane. Gosh, Morozova. You were such a powerful early game ally. Like, I thought, I honestly, I was considering replacing you. And then I was like, no, why? Why, why would I? You've been so good, so reliable, so early. But... You fell. I'm sorry. I, I didn't see it coming. I thought you were going to stomp that thing. Stomp that bird right out of the sky. And then... Ugh, I'm sorry. It was... I'm not, I just don't know enough about him. Who, who knows what a level 13 Togekiss has? Level 17, I guess. <sighs> Farewell, friend. You'll be missed. Ugh, that sucks. Oh, well, leave your condolences for Morozova down in the towel section below. Well, our strongest Pokemon in the box is Andrea. Don't think we're bringing Andrea on, though. We have Psychic Flying. We have Ghost Flying. Ah, we could also go Ditto. That could be fun. Um, and we have Poison Dark, which I think maybe just at, just at the moment, I'm going to move that on because we don't have any Poison type or Dark type on the team yet so that gives us coverage in a couple of ways uh and you know oh what scratch focus energy and poison gas so not a lot of attacks just yet but uh they normally grow pretty quick from this stage so that's good at the very least did we heal we should heal we should heal everyone else oh goodness well you guys, I think that might be where we're gonna call it for today. We cleared out the Slowpoke well. We caught two new friends. We uh, enlisted the aid of Kurt, the Pokeball maker, and we got ourselves a second gym badge, but it came at the cost of Morozova, the Stantler, the first loss. I really thought, I was like so impressed with how good the early team was. And I was like, wow, wow. So that's a bummer. That's a bummer. I'm sure Andrea in the box will be sad. She loved hanging from those antlers. But this is how it goes sometimes. <sighs> Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to leave your condolences for Morozova in the comments down below. Leave a like. Leave a like for Morozova. Let's see how many likes we can get. I think last time the like goal was 2,000. Let's make it. Let's make it 2,001. Just to just you know, we go a little bit higher this time. We're going to get. We'll see. We'll see uh, if we can get there. That'd be very exciting. Thank you so much for watching. 
Um, anyway, don't forget to leave a comment so that you can uh, potentially have a Pokemon named after you in a future episode. Uh, and subscribe so you don't miss any future episodes from us. But until next time, bye! Spork.